Hi, this is GED teacher Damon Tennant here on the home page of my very own website, mygedlive.com. And what I want to show you today is a brand new GED math practice test that I've uploaded. It's free for anyone who is serious about knowing where they stand on the GED math test. So again, let me say that one more time. If you are serious about wanting to know where you stand with the GED math, then this is a 15 question test. So if you've been to my website before, you will know that the previous test was 10 questions. I've added more questions to give you more breadth of what you're going to see on the actual GED test. And this test is designed to show you where you are. So let me go ahead and scroll down uh, on my web page and you'll just see a few things here. You'll see some of the things that I offer here um, on my website, but that's not the point of this video. So let me go ahead and keep on going down and then at the bottom of the, 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 the home page there you just click on that link it'll take you to this practice test okay it's very simple to use you can use this on your Mac you can use it on your PC you can use it on your smartphone your iPhone your Android phone whatever you got and you see it's designed to show you where you're at and you see that you need to get 11 out of 15 okay and so you're just gonna go ahead and put your name there so in my case I'm Damon and Damon at mygedlive.com is my email address and so I'm going to submit and then for example you're going to get a question here you know click on the location of the grid that represents point four and negative three so if you know anything about the coordinate plane you know that the first point is always X uh, on the uh, coordinate plane and the second point is always Y on the Y axis here so the X axis and the Y axis so point X is four so I'm going to see four and I'm going to come down here um, a point Y is negative three that's across so that point's going to be right there and submit see my answer is correct and then I'm able to move on and so these are the kinds of things that you're going to see in this test you click continue it drops you to the next question uh, gives you some questions for computation gives you some word problems some multiple choice um, you know give you some of the drop down list kinds of questions uh, you can come down here to give you some of the drag and drop. This is one of the quadratic equation questions. I have no idea what the answer is here, um, but uh, no, didn't get that right. But then when you get it wrong, it tells you where you can go with the Might Get Your GED Now Test Preparation Series program to get more information uh, to help you uh, to understand that concept and get those questions as you're going to see them on the GED test here. You can go further through and then it kind of shows you your, your results as you go through uh, another word problem of course you remember the GED test is heavy on word problems um, you can come on down and and see you know some of the questions you're going to type in the field you get some of those questions where you have to click and expand um, so anyway I want to encourage you just simply to come here and take this test and and just to let everyone know you know finish it I get the results of everybody's test score and you'd be surprised how many people do two, three or four questions and just give up and leave the test. Don't do that. If you're serious about passing the GED math test and if you're serious about wanting to know where you are, finish the test. You owe it to yourself to finish it, to see where you are and then get the next steps that are going to put you in a position to pass this test. So www.mygedlive.com right here in the, the the notes section of this video you can just simply click on that link and it'll take you right to my web page and you can jump right into the practice test today also do me a favor if you find this kind of content helpful then please go ahead and give a like on this video YouTube will see that this video is liked and we'll share it with more people who are looking for the same kinds of information that you're looking for uh, again so right in the notes of this video if you're on your smartphone you, you might have to you know kind of scroll down a little bit to see the actual notes underneath this video if you're on your PC you'll see them pretty readily right below the video but again uh, this is designed for you to know where you're at uh, and so you can take the next steps you need to pass the GED math test and also the other three tests, the science, the social studies, and the reasoning through language arts. Again, this is Damon Tennant uh, with mygedlive.com and inviting you to come take my brand new practice test. I've just uploaded it this week. I uh, hope you enjoy it.